Welcome to IBC 2025. This year we bring together our global media, technology and entertainment clients showcasing their groundbreaking innovations right here in Amsterdam. Well, it's day three and I'm here with Judy from Kiloview. Thank you so much for your time. How is the show going so far? Uh, so far, so good. The first two days was super, super busy. Yeah, yeah. that's the way you like it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> and why is it so busy? Why are, why are you getting so many people at the stand? So, you know, Kiloview is doing AV over IP. So this year, actually, we have quite a lot of uh, new stuff coming, especially uh, the products, you know, uh, we are doing the um, unified platform for all the stuff putting together to get putting it as a whole workflow for like the broadcast studios and all those things. So a simplification at the core of what you're doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is actually a kind of a very innovative solution in this industry. No one else is doing that. So, and also exactly that's making the whole workflow easier to manage, uh, flexible to combine the solutions, as well as also, you know, expandable for any of the third party to make the whole workflow even even complete. Yeah. So that's, that's, that's actually very exciting and attracting a lot, lot, lot of attention. But it's a really exciting time for the industry in general right now. Yeah. And and as well, I wanted to pick up that there's a, a, an anniversary, a 10th anniversary of NDI, of course. Let's talk about that. Yeah, so Kiloview is one of the very earliest adopter of NDI since almost 10 years ago. Yeah. So this IBC is the 10th anniversary of NDI and we are also celebrating our journey with NDI. So right now from our booth you can see we have a full range of the products that can support NDI covering from encoding to the management, routing, multi-view recording to uh, decoding and all available now or yeah, yeah yeah all available and also you know we are not not just owning an NDI adopter we also help to improve NDI making NDI even better so even uh, at this show we are also showcasing the co-development of NDI and the Kilo View together the latest NDI technology uh, NDI 6.3 and, and what kind of feedback are you getting what are customers saying so NDI 6.3, the biggest uh, improvement is about the latency. So NDI 6.3 with our co-development te te technology, we worked it together, we will be able to bring down the latency to like less than one frame. So that's incredible, I have to say, you know, previously NDI, the latency would be like uh, three, four frames. And now if it's less than one frame, that means a big improvement and making NDI to be more uh, applicable for like industries that really are very strict for uh, the latency, like for medical, for sports, for those kind of events, and also for transmission parts. The lower latency, the better. So yes. this- but, but let's just focus on that. Just, just to kind of recap, what are the benefits of that? Yeah, of course. So as we know, the IP technologies, people are just transmitting the audio video over internet. If comparing with the traditional way, like the basement, of course, there will be higher latency. So if we would be able to bring down the latency and even, you know, less than one frame visibly, there's no difference, yeah. right? So that actually can bring NDI to more different applications and from the users, of course, it will have better experience. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So you're getting positive feedback anyway. Yeah, yeah, of course, a lot of positive feedback and the customers are looking forward to it. And we also, of course, we are integrating the NDI 6.3 to some of our products already. So that's actually with the latest NDI technologies, we'll be able to bring the high quality image, um, image qualities, HDR, and also lower latency. That's what all customers are looking forward to, and also based our products, we will be able to support all different protocols, not just NDI, but also like SRT, uh, interlaced encoding, and also we are inserting quite a lot of the functions for the broadcast users. So that will making IP to be more or widely adopted by the broadcasters. 
Wow, it's mind blowing. You've been busy. Yeah, yes, of course. So that's exactly you know, the reasons why Kilview Booth is always very busy and uh, the ideas, uh, the you know, the overall trends to move into IP and also our our ideas, the ecosystems, bringing everything together, unified, manage it uh, through the internal network, then less cables and also, you know, open to the third party software to build your own solutions, everything is exciting. <laughs> and I guess that's the beauty of events like this, where people can all come together and collaborate and partnerships are formed and, and ideas for the future. Yeah. And, and, and with that in mind, what, you know, where is the future? It's a big question, I know, but how would you answer that? Uh, so for Kilview, we have been in AV over IP for many years, yeah. of course. So uh, with our current development, as I mentioned, our RF02, the unified platform. So we are putting those products for more and more, uh, like the you know the broadcast and also the sports users, and they always give us the feedback what is missing. So for us, we will keep doing AV over IP. Well, at the same time, we will, you know. Actually, well, there is also a kind of, uh, you know, the concept what we are going to do in the future, like we would be uh, focusing more for audio parts. So audio and also just trying to do more accurate synchronization. That's what the broadcasters are looking forward to. And also even the concept of like bringing uh, network management uh, visualized uh, uh, manageable so that's also for you know for the IP industry customers are looking forward to because right now if using IP it seems is uh, virtual so it's not touchable there's no cable you cannot really manage it but for for us we are going to build a kind of platform yes. that will be able to visualize the manage everything and even AI, you know, here I think this is yeah. a topic. Yeah, yeah. Everyone is it's the hottest topic yeah, of the show. Yeah. So even we are also doing something related to AI. Okay. Um, yeah, the first thing we have done is to, you know, get AI into the recorder and also to support the playback and all those things. So yeah, that's what we are going to do next. It sounds like listening to customers and responding and working with them to find the right solutions is, is really what you're all about. Yeah, exactly. That's what Kilovie is always doing. Yeah. It sounds like you're doing a great job. Thank you so much for your time today and good luck with the rest of the show. Thank you so much, Joe.